and welcome back to Mr. Faith's playthrough. I just realized that we should have been leveling up a two month slots because apparently I only got one. Yeah, so I can't even equip my force right now. I have an idea. I have an idea. I just got a hell of a lot of souls from this guy. And if this one, I know I can't use that for anything because that will acquire some strength, strength weapon. So you know what? Let's use this shit. Use Core and Ivy Golem. No! Twelve thousand souls because then we can level up the two minutes. Get three, get four two minute slots, and one in endurance. Thank you. Now we we'll level 19 instead. That come in handy. That that come quite in handy. God damn it! You need to attune it. Let's attune the boss. Now we got three attunement slots already. That is nice. Let us continue up here. Below here. Right up there is the dragon. If you fire around, I think it's around 50, 50 arrows in his tail, he will drop the Drake Sword. Which is actually a piece of crap, but newbies will actually like that weapon a lot. But not me. I don't like it one bit. Let's try out the Force Miracle. Oh! <coughs> Bastard. I actually wanted push to push him over the cliff, but come on, little man. Come on. Oh, oh, crap! Damn it, I'm poisoned. Well, we gotta live with that. Man, I always get poisoned here. <laughs> I don't know why. Hmm, you know what? I actually got a better idea. Yeah, I do. Let's do that instead. We want to open the shortcut to the file link altar instead. So let us just run back. I should have done that instead of going this way. What you live and you learn. Should we risk it? Yeah, we we risk it while we poison. Alright, no problem. Oh. Well, this could get ugly, but let's see how we do it. Alright, we want the dragon to attack us, and then we can run past his... through his feet. Come on. Oh. Just stand here, wait for him. Heal. We have to deal with the poison effect as well. Come on. He will attack me very soon. Come on, hurry up. There he is. Oh, run, 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 run. Yeah! Oh, thank you very much. Phew! Look at him. Oh, fire breathing up! You, you see, that could have gotten ugly. <laughs> because now we have a neat little shortcut in here, and that is giving us access to the filing altar right out here. I think we can 
no, we can't do that just yet. We need to be faith something or other. Then the, the Sunbro will actually stand there and we can join his covenant. And we want to do that. We want to do that. But not yet. We want to continue with the game first and kill innocent. Not really innocent, but you know. Whoop! Oh yeah, that guy. Come on. He's coming. Oh! Uh oh. <laughs> Just stick it in there. <laughs> and stick it in there again. And that's the end of that guy. Pretty easy once you know the uh, the little secret that you actually need to stick that inside his rectum. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's funny. That's funny. We can level up again. Let's get some more faith. Or should we get some more endurance? Nah, fuck endurance. Let's get some more faith. Was that enough to get the sun bro to appear? Maybe it was. No, it wasn't. We come back a little later. Hello. Goodbye. Goodbye. Whoop. Hello, soldier waist club. Waist club. Can you use that for anything? Come on. Oh, crap. Sorry, comparing there. There we are. Wait a minute, you don't really need to go up there. Let's just carry on past this shit and go down here. Is anyone following me? Yes, he is. And down he goes. And right here is a trap. Whoop! Oh, he's already dead. Let's heal for that. Man, the cleric is actually pretty cool. Come on, guys. Whoa! Bash! Hit me! I don't like it when you guys hit me. <laughs> Whoop. Gotta go down and get the uh, mystery key that is down here. Here we are. Mystery key. We need that to free Lord Shrek. And either kill him or kill him later. <laughs> either way, options don't look good for him. Let's see, didn't we got a hell of a lot of uh, fire bombs? Here we are. And you can get this, my friend. Here we are. And there we are. Whoop! We need this item out here. Let's be very careful. <laughs> Any more of those guys? No, doesn't look like it. So, let us traverse the white light. And that brings us here, right? Oh, wait a minute. No. Hello, my friend. 
the bomb, my friend. Um, let's actually do this way. Nothing? Yeah, the big guy didn't see me. All right. Come on. And you die. Now I think the big guy sees me. Come on. Come on. Ah! You ain't drinking nothing, you bastard. All right. Now we got. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> I got his feet right between my arm. <laughs> Bastard. All right. Uh oh. Forget all about that, my friend. And we've got this guy with the crossbow. Now he's not here anymore. Bye bye. So before we're going in there, we have to go down and visit Mr. Blacksmith. Your very best friend in this game. And before we continue up with the first boss, we actually need to go down and get an ember in the forest. A divine ember. Because divine weapons will be our friend in this playthrough. And we want to make something divine. I'm not pretty sure not sure yet what weapon we want to make divine, but let's find out. Hello. Well, you must be a good boy. I sure am. Not a story. Smithing, then speak to me, my friend. Mate, I need so much smithing you don't know what half of it. Ah, what weapon can we actually? Hmm. Crossbow. I don't really know what weapon yet, but let us just purchase two of these bad boys and I'll see you later. We need to go down and get the ember. To get that, we will be running past this guy. What? Oh, yes, thank you. That brings us to the Dark Root Forest. And we'll just make a quick stop down here to get the Ember. Thank you. Darkwood Garden, yes, of course. Whoop! And down he goes. Oh. Oh, that didn't kill him. Whoa! Thank you. Kill this buddy. Kill this buddy. 
we got some musk clumps and that will actually prevent our poisonous effects a bit later. Right here is a door that requires 20,000 souls to open, so we will do that later. But we will be attacking this wall, revealing a secret bonfire. Thank you very much. Let's put our ass down here. If everything goes wrong. And let us just run down and kill the butterfly. The moonlight butterfly. <coughs> Which will grant us access to the divine ember. Alright. So far, so good. I bet you didn't see that coming, huh? <laughs> that wasn't the branches, that was snakes' enemies. Oh crap. Now we need to deal with this guy. Let's see how that goes. Come on, my friend. Uh. Ah! You ain't nothing! You're nothing! <laughs> the thing is, every time he attacks you, hurry up and get your shield down. You can summon Witch Beatrice. She's actually a secret NPC, because you have to trash the bush like I did to... <laughs> the bush. <laughs> to get her to appear. Hi, bitch! And she will actually kill the Moonlight Butterfly for me without I having to do anything, so things couldn't be more easy right now as they are. So let us advance. There it is. Move it, bitch. Kill him. Where the hell are you going? He's over there, bitch! Ow! Finally, she starts attacking him. I can't really do anything until he sits down. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh, that was a uh, pretty fail right there. I should have rolled, but I I couldn't really roll because of that stupid bitch. She was in my way. <laughs> now we have to use the humanity. Yeah, fuck it, let's just use one. Because I need to be alive in order to summon her one more time. So let's try this one more time. Man, I can't believe I just died there. Man, I suck. I suck so bad. <laughs> well, at least we can just run for it. Let's just fuck the uh, stone golem and just run for it. We have a shield that protects a little better against magic. Should not enough, but let's go with this one instead. Nothing. And let's just run past this guy. Here we are. Summon the bitch. Oh crap. 
crap. Oh, one shot it. Damn, she's powerful, man. Ah, oh, let's try this one more time. Oh shit, 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 shit. Let's see. Kill him. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Kill him. Kill him. Alright, I'll finish him then. I guess not. And thank you Beatrice and goodbye. Soul of the Moonlight Butterfly. Now I got two of these bad boys. <laughs> you see? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Soul of the Moonlight Butterfly. I have two. <laughs> nice. We got a little extra souls in our pockets, so let us go up and get the Divine Emperor. <laughs> Gotta be careful not to fall down here, i actually done that a couple of times. <laughs> Divine Emperor, thank you very much. And a Homeward Bone. Pocket. Let's just use it. We don't want to run all the way back. There we go. What? Didn't I use it? Thank you very much. All right, people. We will continue in the next part. So I hope you're enjoying this. Things are going very easy at the moment. So uh, let us hope that things will turn a little bit harder later. But uh, I'll see you in the next part with Mr. Faith. Goodbye.